Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today we have a super fun video and Paul is gonna come in in a while and I'm gonna show him my wish list. This is gonna be a wish list that it's not obviously things that I wanna get this year because we are already in November but it's like overall things that I've been liking. This is not gonna be my Christmas wish list. I do have that video coming a little bit closer to the holidays. It's something that you guys requested and I always have a ton of fun editing these videos because of his faces and his comments and expressions. So yeah, let's get into this video. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Lou and I make tons of videos about handbags, especially handbags, shoes, clothing, anything luxury. So if you like anything like that, please consider subscribing to my channel and click the notification bell down below so you don't miss any of my videos. Before we start, I just wanted to let you guys know that this video is sponsored by Spiritual Gloss. I've shot from them before and I'm actually really excited to be working with them. You guys know that November is quite hectic because of Black Friday sales and everything. So I just wanted to share with you some pieces that I truthfully am loving. I don't know what's happening but I'm really into jewelry lately. So the first one that I want to talk about is this diamond necklace. The thing about spiritual gloss, they make all the pieces in Miami, Florida and I love the pieces they have because they have very fun edgy pieces but they also have very simple like me. I really like simple dainty jewelry. So I got this diamond necklace that I'm gonna show you on close-ups but I love this one so much. It's that piece that you always want to have to layer with something else and I've been looking for a solid gold with a diamond necklace for a while now and now that I found this I'm really happy about it. It's available in yellow gold, rose gold and white gold and it's 14 carats and the other one that I've been loving so much is this one. So this is a herringbone necklace and just so you guys know a little bit of how it looks on me and it's reversible so it has the gold side but it also has this other side that I find so so stunning and it's 18 karat gold vermeil. I don't know if I pronounced that correctly so I'm hoping that this lasts me for a really long time. All of these pieces I don't plan to take them off. I wanted stuff that I could go into the ocean with them to shower and not really have to worry because I'm a lazy person sometimes and I just like to have my jewelry with me all the time not to even mention like the quality is really really good but I need to show you my favorite pieces and my favorite pieces are actually rings and I like rings but I have really small hands and sometimes they are very very uncomfortable so I wanted to have dainty rings that I would not feel on my hand and that I could leave them on all the time so I'm gonna show you two and this one is my favorite piece so far and I have it on this hand of course you cannot see it on the camera but again I'm gonna put b-roll of everything and this one is solid gold with diamonds but I can definitely stack this one with my love ring and it has real diamonds it's also available in white gold which I know that many of you guys like I prefer yellow gold on pretty much any piece that I have and I have this other one that it's like a wave super super pretty and I have it on the same hand as my love ring they don't clash against each other like super super comfortable I honestly really love them I've been staring at my hands all day because it's like I really like diamonds but I don't like them to be like super super flashy and this is so pretty and so perfect so I highly recommend you if you want to get a piece definitely this ring the one with the little crown with diamonds I'm so in love with the piece finally I'm gonna show you the earrings that I got they're super small they definitely have bigger sizes but this ones I got them because they're super comfortable and you don't really even have to take them off to sleep or to anything they're also solid gold with real diamonds and spiritual gloss has the diamond tennis necklace that I've been looking for you guys know that I've been talking about that so I don't know I don't know I know that like if you spend so much on bags like at this point spending on diamonds and gold seems like a really good investment at least for myself I don't know stacking that one with my love bracelet would be super super cute so I don't know maybe for Christmas I hope that I can get that because I have a full Pinterest board about that freaking tennis bracelet that I'm just so in love with so let's see how that goes so I know that it's super early on November but Black Friday starts now so I would suggest you guys to go check their website and take advantage of the discount codes and maybe you can even start buying Christmas presents for your family and friends because you know sometimes like I try to buy the Christmas presents way beforehand because then just you it's really hard to find something for everyone so yeah if you are interested in gifting any type of jewelry to your family or friends spiritual gloss is amazing I'm definitely gonna get some pieces at least for Polo's sister that I know that, that she wanted a little ring I just need to figure out what's her size I hope that she's not watching this video so yeah thank you so much spiritual gloss for sponsoring this video 
and now let's get into the video with Polo. So we have him here. Thank you for filming with me. And we're gonna be reacting to my wish list. Do you think that you kind of know what, what I want to get? I kind of know, yeah. I don't know what your reactions are gonna be, but I hope that you like at least the stuff that I want to get. But feel free to give your comments. So <laughs> let's start with the first one. You're gonna be familiar with this one because you kind of wanted me to get this one instead of the black Birkin that I got. And it's um, the Birkin 25 in gold. Yeah, I told you to get this one when we were at the store instead of the of the black one. But it, it doesn't make sense. You said to me on a past video that you actually didn't like the caramel color on the 19 bag. Mm, and nine, no, well, this is different. It's not that different. Yeah. I it, do like this more instead of the black one. Oh, you really? You do? Yeah. <laughs> I think like for winter it's gonna be better with your outfits and all that stuff. <laughs> so you say that I should get this one yeah. even off the, of the price tag? Well, if you compare it with a uh, Chanel right now. Oh, he knows about the price increases. Yeah. <laughs> he was like, no way, they're not increasing a thousand dollars. And I was like, no, yeah, they're gonna do it. And then when I showed him that it happened, he was like, they're crazy. Yeah, right now, uh, an Hermes is gonna be like a little bit more than a Chanel, but. No, actually, no, I asked, and a Jumbo is actually more expensive than a Birkin 25, wow. at least in Mexico. So it's the same price. Well. And I think that you can even tell that the quality is not the same between the bags. So, yeah, it's crazy. Okay, so we can assume that you approve of a Birkin 25 in gold if I get it, if I get offered the bag, but yeah, next. Okay, so you saw this one in... it was Houston? Yeah, in Houston. Yeah, we went to Van Cleef in Houston and I tried the Onyx one and the Pearl, is it Mother Pearl? And I don't know if you liked it, but I kind of want one and I don't know if I, I should buy it for my birthday. I think I do like but the one in, in black. The Onyx one? I don't know <laughs> the name. Uh, it's, it's called Onyx. Okay. Why do you like the black one better? You're more of a white clothing person. Yeah, that's true, but I think it's more like elegant, the, the black one. So if I were to get this one in New York for my birthday, would you approve? Yeah. Well, you don't pay for it, that's okay. <laughs> oh, so it's this one. Yeah, with the earrings also. You would also get the matching earrings? Yeah. Isn't it like a little bit too much to have like both of them? No, if you only wear the, the necklace and the earrings, I think it's okay. If you wear it with another necklace and... Like this? Oh, that's nice. This one? Yeah. You like it? He likes it. So if I get this next one, you're actually gonna be happy because then if I get it, the keeple is officially yours and I know that you like to use it. Okay, so which... Okay, so back. the one that I want to get is um, like this humongous classic flop. I don't know. I think it's not gonna fit that much stuff like in the keeple, you know? I think it's uh, like very... I, like I think that it's a decent size, but at the same time I understand what you mean, but I don't want to carry that much anyway. It gets super heavy. Well, you know, if it's gonna be like a weekend trip, I think you couldn't oh, pack all your much. stuff. Yeah, there. Yeah, I think you're right. But the looks of it, like, let's not talk about functionality. Well, the looks is just looked like a classic flap. But like a slouchy one, it's super chic. Or there's like the Maxi 19 bag, I don't know if you like the Maxi 19 bag a little bit more. more. You don't know? No. You don't care? Yeah, you, you cannot fit anything in there. It's just like a like a never full. That's the point. It's like an expensive never full but with a flap. And it's Chanel. Okay, so I hope that you like this one because you like small bags on me. You're always like, oh, that small bag is super cute. Yeah. So I want a mini Kelly. I don't mind the color. Like, how mini is that? No, that's that's too small. You, you can barely <laughs> fit your phone in there. You, I can fit my phone in yeah? there. Yeah, I, I've asked. And the mini Kelly fits the iPhone 12 Pro Max. Okay. What it doesn't fit is your phone, your wallet, and your keys when we go yeah, out. So, no, no, not, no, approved, no. <laughs> not approved. Yeah, it's too small. This cardigan because I really really love the contrast and I like that it says Coco and on the back I think it says Chanel but I don't know if you're gonna like it I know no but you're usually approving of ready to wear pieces yeah but not I don't like this style like the Coco writing and the like stripe yeah. like the zigzag yeah, you don't the like the zigzag zig stripe yeah I don't like it okay but there's this other one that I want that you told me that it was cute that I should get the white one with a little like lock Chanel locks yeah it could be or or just like a black one with Chanel in white or... oh, like a advertisement well what is that the next one I'm hesitating between two colors and maybe you can choose so I want a classic flap you know that I like classic flaps. Yeah, I know. and <laughs> I was between uh, this like lilac color and there's a mean green it's a super light shade of green but i'm not sure which one to get so i would love your opinion yeah i think i like more the like <laughs> yeah i think i like more the lilac 
<risa> Lilac. Ok. <risa> no puedo. Okay. Lilac. Lilac. Ok, ahora digo Lilac. Lilac. <risa> ok, so for some reason, he cannot say Lilac. <risa> so I'm just gonna say it for him. He likes the Lilac better. It's not that funny. <risa> I, but he... Lilac. <risa> ok. <laughs> he likes the lilac better. Yeah. Can the, you can you explain why? Yeah, I think the green one is like too light. Yeah, maybe. I have not seen it in person though. But we saw the lilac on the store. Yeah, yeah. and it was very nice. Yeah, I like. But it was a nineteen bag. I wanted well, to see but the, the color. Is the same. Okay, so you rolled lilac. Yeah. Even with the clothes that I wear, like I kind of think that green would. Yeah, be... but with the green, what you're talking about? Color transfer? No, yeah. I'm talking about like shades. Like I use a lot of like blacks and beiges. You and can I... go. Maybe. Okay, so this next one kinda involves you, and I would love to know if you are actually down for it, but. But you know that we're moving and we're gonna have to sell everything that we own and then buy it again. So I was wanting a Louis Vuitton trunk as a coffee table but a vintage one with a glass on top. Yeah. Like this. Yeah. What with the with the glass on top it can be yeah. really nice. But only like for the living room? Yeah for the living room. Because your mom has this trunk, it's not the Vuitton, but it's really cute and I like the way that it looks on the living yeah. room. So if I found one I can definitely put this on our living room. Yeah but it, it has to be a big one. Okay big one and super vintage. Well, and I, don't care about I have this other idea to have it as a like a bedside no. table. No I don't like it. Why? No, for the bedside, no. I like more Only for, for the, my side. No. Does if you want it like in your vanity or something like that. But you do like it. It's funny, I would not think that you would like a big monogram piece on your house. Like an old one, yeah. Vintage. Yeah, yeah but like very used one. Oh, Maybe yeah. Maybe you can see like the stamps or... A little bit cool. Yeah. Okay, so the next one, it's a vintage, like super, super vintage Kelly in black in this like shiny leather. Oh, it's nice. You yeah. like it. And I would like it in a little bit of a bigger size than the Kelly. I know that you love my Kelly. It's your favorite bag that I have. So I was looking for... That's a 25. I wanted it 28, which is like just a little bit bigger. Yeah, I think a 28 it can be good for you because it's not like too big. And it's and not too small. Yeah, and it's not too small. <laughs> yeah, and I kind of like it. Like, it looks like super cool. Yeah, and it's vintage and it can be like a yeah, nice piece. Yeah, I love vintage stuff. It's a nice piece. Now, I, you know that I don't have a bag for my computer, so you have to sometimes stick it in your backpack it's a heavy computer so i was really wanting a chanel deville this striped it's i like don't beige. know about it looks like a beach bag you know to put the towels the sunscreen yeah it, it kind of has like the vintage like beach bag vibe but i like it for office no no i don't think so and um like not really school because we're not really even going yeah. to school because it's online uh, but okay let's say that it's just a bag for anything like traveling bitch whatever yeah it's Do you nice. like it yeah, yeah. I like it. colors are very me yeah okay but like i said it's more like a bitch bag it kind of looks like a bitch bag i agree <laughs> Now, I would love, uh, you know, that I'm into jewelry a lot. Mm -hmm. um, and I would like the Juke bracelet. How do you say Justin Clue? Justin Clue. So I would like the, either the bracelet or the ring. I don't know which one do you like better. But I remember that you kind of like this one when we went yeah. to the store. Yeah, the Justin Clue, I like it more for bracelet instead of the ring. Yeah, I kind of like it. It's like too bulky for the, the ring. The thin one on the bracelet because the thick one was a little bit too big on me. Okay. Yeah, but I'm, I'm happy that you like yeah. it. Rose gold or yellow gold? Maybe rose gold. You have the the gold, no. This is um yellow. Yellow gold. Yeah. And last but not least, I, I really, really want a diamond tennis bracelet. And I don't know if you're going to like it because you're going to be like, oh, it's too bling bling, too much. So I don't know if you will approve of me. Oh, but it's like the little ones. Yeah, it's going to be like, dang, I don't want like a chunky diamond, like super out there. <laughs> I actually really want like something small, dainty, but like pretty. Yeah, that... is it like thin one yeah, with thin little one. diamonds? It can be. A, a nice idea. Okay, so that was the wish list. I'm quite surprised that you like almost everything. I think all the ones that you didn't like were the mini Kelly. Yeah, no. The Chanel extra extra large flap. Mm, yeah, nope. And the Duville. And the Duville. You don't like? You said that you liked it. I liked it, but not for what you want to do it. Oh, got it. If would you add anything to my wish list? That something that you maybe see out there that you would be like, oh, that's cute. Nope. No. No. Nope. Enough shopping <laughs> yeah. for me. <laughs> Okay, so if, in case anyone is interested, his wish list is basically an air fryer, yeah. 
I'm not joking. Probably uh, bottles of champagne and stuff for the boat that are way more expensive than any bag that I mentioned on this video. So if anyone's gonna ask me, what do you give to him? It's always super hard to gift you anything because you hate every piece of clothing. You hate shoes, you hate everything and you only want like stuff for the boat that are like $10,000. So it's really hard to give him yeah, it's an anything. expensive hobby. It's an expensive hobby. So thank you so much for coming to my channel. It's really nice to have you as a guest. <laughs> We're gonna try to practice on that lilac word. We're having a lot of... Only if you get it. Only if I get it, because yeah. if I get it, you're gonna be like the la 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 la. <laughs> So yeah, thank you so much for coming. Thank you so much guys for watching. If you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing and click that notification bell down below so you don't miss any of my videos. And if you're not done watching, I'm gonna leave you two videos right here in case you wanna check them out. And yeah, thank you and see you on the next one. Bye.